and we're back with today's Channel 9 News at 6 o'clock. I'm your host, Dick Johnson, and, uh, well, uh, this is Suburban Adventures Weekly. Now, well, uh, for our top story tonight, I'm just gonna bring it right out to you. Uh, our producers actually have a, uh, a new teleportation device for the, uh, for the set. So I'm just gonna demonstrate what this little gadget does. Now, uh, now watch this. Okay, so I'm here. See me here? Okay, now watch this. Oh, what you looking there? I just popped up from there to here. Who knew? <laughs> well, okay. So, uh, so, uh, for one of our stories tonight, we got, uh, we got an Iraq report. But, uh, let's not get into that right now. Let's go with, uh, Dingo with the traffic report. Dingo. Hey there! So, you know, you're gonna be backed up on the zoo interchange right here. So you gotta take a detour down to Mexico right here. This is Mexico. Right there. And then... Then you gotta cross the border, okay? I'm talking about the border. Ooh. Well, that teleportation device ain't working too well. Hey there! I'm Jackhawk9000 with the weather. As you can see here, it's a big front coming in. Big front. You know, it's probably gonna be about 12,000 pounds of front. It's gonna, that's gonna mess up your day. So, if you're trying to get to work, probably go around here, you know, right in this area, right there. You know what you gotta do? There's gonna be lots of wind. It's gonna be 80 miles an hour. Someone's gonna die. I don't know who. Okay, so as you can see here, all this rain, all this garbage, it's gonna ruin your work day. And now for the weekly forecast with Dick Johnson. Dick. And we're back. Oh, I guess we're in Iraq. The uh, the teleportation device does work. And uh, oh, it looks like my tech producer just set me up with a uh, with a. <laughs> that means that he's very frustrated with work. Uh, this is a native here from Iraq, and uh, bomb. Well, bomb translates to uh, cell phone. So if you ever hear it in Iraq on an airplane, say uh, say uh, uh, bomb. Bye, bomb. If you, ever, if, if you ever hear, now he's getting frustrated with his cell phone. If you ever hear an Iraqi on an airplane say bomb, he, all he's trying to say is, cell phone, cell phone, I'm very frustrated with my cell phone. You know, it's crazy like that. Now, let me let me just take a gander at his cell phone here. As you can see the uh, cell phone. Ooh, he's getting a message. Well, let's uh, let's let's see who is by. Shall we? Hello? Hey. Oh, you know, I'm, I'm filming with my buddy here. America, man? Well, fine. That was his boss. And what did he say about. Oh, whoa! Now he's getting very frustrated with work. Well, uh, that Iraq thing was a little bit crazy. Um, now, as you can see behind me, I have a good friend of mine, Bobblehead. He is, uh, well, what, is, what does the real Bobblehead say that he is? He is uh, Robin Yant. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that name, but uh, Robin. So, uh, what, what is your what is your favorite thing to do being bobblehead? Well, I always like to shake my head for the thrill of the distraction. For the thrill of the what? Yeah. Okay. Um, next question. Why do you, do you enjoy being your having your head bobble around like this? Well, I started going to the doctor every day. Yeah, sure. Not. Can, can you elaborate a little bit? What, what do you mean go to the doctor every day? Well, I break my neck twice a day, and it's very painful, but you know, I'm still alive, so yeah. Wow, I mean, does that does that hurt? No. Okay, so uh, uh, do you have any other friends like in the bobblehead world? Because I, I have a few right here. I have, uh, who is this? Prince Fielder, ooh. Yeah. And, and I have, uh, who is this guy? C Cecil Cooper? I, I, I'm not a baseball player myself, so. Uh, and, uh, and then next on our uh, next on our little agenda here, I have another question for you. Really quick. Uh, who is your best friend being on? Definitely Prince Fielder because you know he always brings a pizza to the party. He brings a pizza to the party. Why yes! Is that is that a uh, is that a metaphor or is that like a phrase of some sort? Or? No, no, he literally brings the pizza to the party. To to the party. What you make it sound like it's the party, like it's what, what is. What is, what is the party? Why, yes! Well, that's all the time we have today, so I'm sorry about that, Mr. Robin, but, uh, well, 
there's Robin for you, and, uh, well, this is Suburban Adventures Weekly. Join us next week on Suburban Adventures Weekly. I'm Dick Johnson, and I'll see you later.